Hiya, fishy folks. Happy Water Change Wednesday. Hope everyone's having a great day and a great week. Almost a Friday. Looking forward to that. I've been pondering something. That's my pondering face in case you wanted to know. So you all know I'm a guppy nerd. Love the guppies. 50 tanks or so in the fish room, 45 of them have guppies in them. I breed guppies to sell. Um, I like all the different colors. I like the interaction. I like the babies. I like making money by selling them, but I like guppies. I have guppies. I have a planted angel tank upstairs. My wife really likes angels. I like angels too, but you know, um, but I'm thinking I need to broaden my horizons. I'm thinking that after hanging out with some really cool cichlid folk at the Bucks County Aquarium Society auction, Lisa from Super Cichlids, Scott and Liz, the king and queen of cichlids, and Alan and Karen, who are just super phenomenal smart people, but they don't have a title, so we might have to give them a title. I'm thinking maybe I need a cichlid tank. I know. <laughs> Mine blown. Now, I have these two Oscars, Han and Leia, in this 90 gallon next to me, um, and there's a giant Pleco in there, and there was a black ghost knife, but anyway, I'm thinking maybe I turn this into a South American tank. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Here's the problem. I don't know anything about that. Nothing. Zero. Like, I'm a complete noob. Call me Cichlid Noob. That's going to be a new channel. Cichlid Noob. Maybe I'll be like, like a new character on Cichlid Noob. No, because I don't do characters. I'm this way in real life. It's kind of weird. Anyway, back to cichlids. So I don't know anything about cichlids. I'm thinking a South American tank because I have these Oscars and maybe I can add things. I don't know. So here's what I need from you guys in the comments below, especially you, Scott and Liz, because you're the king and queen. And Lisa, you have like 900 gallon tanks in your family room. I need to know what cichlids should I get? Can I get any cichlids? Can I get any other fish that I can add to this 90 gallon tank with Oscars? Now I know these Oscars are gonna get big and I probably won't be able to keep anything with them eventually. So maybe that's not a good idea. Maybe I need to move the Oscars. I need to put them in a different tank. Maybe I don't do a South American tank. Maybe I just leave the Oscars in there with some other stuff. So help me decide what I, sh what I can and what I should do. All right, let's take a look at the, the Oscars, Hannah and Leia, stand by. All right, I know I said we were gonna look at Hannah and Leia, the Oscars, but there's the Pleco. You guys know the story about the Pleco. If you don't, my son had a 55 African tank with about, I don't know, 30 or 36 fish in it. And uh, it was a fantastic tank. It looked great. There was a lot of movement, a lot of color. And uh, he had it for about six months. After about five months or so, fish starting to disappear and die. And he lost interest rather quickly. And the only thing that survived after the, the disaster was this Pleco. And so he was a common Pleco. Uh, we knew when we bought it, it was gonna get big. I just figured, you know, we would handle it, not a big deal. I had him in a 40 gallon down here for a while. And when I set up this 90, I threw him in the 90. And he'll live here probably for quite a while. And then we'll figure out what to do when he gets too big for this tank. Anyway, <coughs> let's talk about Han and Leia. There's Leia, albino tiger Oscar. And there's Han, just a regular tiger Oscar. I really like the colors and pattern on Han. I don't know if that's a boy and a girl, but that's what I'm calling them, a boy and a girl. I don't know how to sex Oscars. I'm assuming you have to vent them, which is kind of weird if you ask me, but why can't they just be like guppies where you just, you know, look at them and you can tell? Anywho, what can I put in this tank with these Oscars? Can I put anything in this tank with this Oscars? That's the question. That's what I need you to answer for me, you cichlid smart folks. IFG, if you're listening, help me out. You're a cichlid guy. And of course, anyone else who wants to answer my question, what can I put in this tank? What do I need to do to this tank to make it more cichlid friendly? If anything, let me know in the comments below. All right, fishy folks, I'm going to leave you with this picture of this really cool red plush pleco from Super Cichlids.
Good morning, fishy folks. Happy Water Change Wednesday coming at you with another video. That looks pretty stupid, doesn't it? Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday on our regularly scheduled program. And there's something on my glasses. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. And today I have a question for you. I'm a guppy nerd. I love guppies and other live bearers. Mostly guppies though, but I really like swordtails too. Mollies are kind of cool. Platties are all right. Guppies are where it's at though. But I have a question. I have an inkling. I have an itch. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday to you. Today, I have a question for you, my subscribers my non-subscribers, anyone who's smarter than me, which is most of you people. <clears throat> Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. Hope everyone is having a great week so far. It's hump day. By the time you watch this, it'll be closer to Saturday, folks. And Saturday is the weekend, and the weekend means no work for a lot of people. If you work on Saturday, that sucks. I did it for many years, I get it. Forget what I just said, it doesn't apply to you. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. Hope everyone's having a great week so far. I know my week has been quite busy, but good. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. Hope everyone's having a great week in their fish keeping business, who cares? Uh. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. Michael from Michael's Fish Room here. Hope everyone's having a great week. I know I certainly am. I have a question for you. Good morning, fishy folks, and happy Water Change Wednesday. I keep saying good morning, but this is going to be released in the afternoon. That's a stupid thing to say. <laughs> 